Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is Tony, aka Shay, coming back with your bi day. So, uh, one thing that's very entertaining is that no rush challenge, and I didn't really understand it, but it's really cool. Just how like you put your your hand on the, the screen, and then once they or something covers the screen, and then when it comes back, it's like a whole different person. I think that's um, man, we are so creative. I don't know who started it. I, I know it's a song that um, came out, but just seeing the, like, just seeing the women transform into something that they weren't before, it's kind of scary to me. It's always been scary to me. And the reason being is I get nervous when a woman's able to change her appearance that much. And I actually have a direct experience with this where I was dating a, I was dating a girl and you know pretty she's Nigerian and I always you know you know usually see her like out and I mean that's how I got to know her so we started dating and then it was that one moment where I saw her without the makeup and I swear she looked completely different and I remember I was just like yo like yo, I was I was like, like it looked like her jaw got smaller. So it just she just looked different, and I was just like, man, what the hell? <laughs> and um, I remember I said to myself, you know what? I can't I can't date women that have a lot of makeup on, or if they never take it off, or if I sorry about that, the video got cut off, ran out of memory. But um, yeah, I was saying I remember uh saying to myself I would never date someone that wears so much makeup and I don't know how they look like naturally like my preference is actually uh, natural look with natural hair I don't like straight hair it reminds me of white women and uh, I like braids or like dreads or like just like the natural afro um, shortcut all that all that is like mad sexy to me but anyways I was thinking about it I was like you know what if we can do what if it was possible to do the no rush challenge to uh, Nigeria or really any other West African country? But imagine if it was able to do it to Nigeria. So, you know, show Nigeria how it how it is now looking out rough or whatever. And then we could put on a lens, um, you know, whatever. I don't know, maybe a book or something. And then when we take it around, um, take it off, it looks like like Dubai times 100. And everyone's like chilling and enjoying good food. There's like peace and we're just moving about, no traffic and, you know, really enjoying it. That would be a nice, damn, I wish that was possible. I bet, I bet it would be a whole migration of uh, us in the, in the diaspora coming back, coming back there and just enjoying it. But yeah, that would, that would definitely be cool. I would love to see something like that.